Hello and welcome to C programming tutorials. In this video, you are going to learn about how to write C program to find out sum of first and last digit of given number. So let's say you have one number that is 2023. Now you are interested in find out the sum of the first digit and last digit of this number that means this this is the first digit and this one is the last digit 3 and the sum of these two number will be equal to 5 so this is what we are interested in so for any number if you want to find out the last digit then we can use this logic let's say this is our number 2023 and we will find out the remainder of this number by dividing it by 10 so here we are interested in the remainder so remainder will be what after dividing 2023 by 10 we will have the remainder as a 3 so that will be our called as a last number now how we can find out the first number so for first digit the logic is like if we divide the number by 10 so it will be like 202.3 and again if you will divide by 10 it will be 20.2 and again if you will divide by 10 it will be 2 how many times we need to divide this number by 10 unless and until it become less than 10 so this is how you can find out the first digit of a number now you know the logic how to find out first and last digit of the number then we need to write a program to write a c program for a last digit it's a simple syntax we need to focus on the modulo that is uh, remainder so here the whatever number it is given modulo by 10 that will be our remainder and it will give us a last digit similarly for the first digit as i said that we need to divide the number by 10 and unless and until it become less than uh, 10 so for that we can write a while loop so we will say that while this number is greater than 10 what we will do we will divide the number by 10 and we will store this value again in the number so in this one what will happen that if we have a 2 not 2 3 divided by 10 it will be 202.3 so it will be stored in this number and again it will be like divide by 10 so it will become 20.2 and so on so this while loop will run unless and until this number will become less than 10 and then it will give a number as a first digit of the particular number okay next we are going to write a program for this logic so let's consider a integer number and first we want number and we can initialize it to 0 then we also need a variable for the first digit then for the last digit and let's say we need a variable for the okay here it will be comma variable for the uh, sum and let's initialize to 0 also okay so first we will ask a user to enter the number so what we will do we will say printf enter the number so user will enter the number over here and for that we will do a scanf so it will read the number from the keyboard and we know it's integer type so we will use person d and address of num so it will be stored whatever number you will enter over here it will be stored in the variable num now we have the number now what is our logic to first to get the last digit what we will say last equal to num modulo 10 so this will provide a remainder and remainder will be stored into last now for the first we know the logic while this num is greater than 10 this while loop should run and here what we will do so we will say that num equal to num divided by 10 so now we have the first also so first equal to 
the num whatever will be the last num we have that will be considered as a first now we will have sum equal to first plus last and we can print this message also let's say print f the sum of first digit and what will be our digit that we will print and last digit equal to and here we will print our answer so for the first digit we will provide a variable first then we have the last and the sum so this is our simple c program let's run it and check it okay it says that enter the number so first we will test for 2023 and let's enter so it says that sum of first digit that is 2 and last digit 3 answer is 5 we can test for one more condition let's say i will write uh, some random number okay so it will be 5 plus 7 so let's see the sum of 5 and last digit is 5. so that's how we can write a simple c program to add a first and last digit of a number thank you so much for watching this video please provide your feedback in the comment thank you